Hello, my name is Rahul. Today I am going to show you how to draw a clock like this using C hash. I am going to use .NET 4.0 framework and Visual Studio 2012. Close it. Create new project. Clock demo. Okay. View code. Now, first we need to create a function to rotate points. Okay. Private wide rotate. Point, point, or int. I rotate, comma, int by angle. Point. Save it, go to form, select form, override paint, ok. Now we need to move origin from top left corner to center of form. E dot graphics dot translate transform bracket this dot size dot width divide by 2 this dot size dot height divide by 2 now create two more functions private wide proc clock graphics e ok private wide draw hands graphics e comma date time comma boolean change 
comma color c okay now we are going to draw clock first point a is equal to new point okay of length 2 now for int i is equal to 0 i is less than 360 i is increment by 6 okay now point bracket 0 is equal to 0 point bracket 0 dot y is equal to 150 okay dot x okay now rotate point pt comma 1 comma i we change it to i angle so you can okay now bracket one dot x is equal to point one dot y is equal to i angle modulus five is equal to zero question mark ten comma five okay all bracket yes not comma that is this okay now we need to subtract zero dot x is equal to p t okay one dot x divided by two okay that is y so we can draw a perfect circle okay now define pen p is equal to new pen bracket color dot rpg from rpg that is 255,0,0,0 okay now e dot draw ellipse bracket pen comma pt bracket 0 dot x comma pt bracket 0 dot y comma pt bracket 1 dot x comma pt bracket 1 dot y okay now we need to fill e dot fill ellipse bracket new solid brush bracket color okay comma pt bracket zero that going to be this is okay now and it's not this okay now 
copy this and paste here. We are going to render it, okay? Now the error. it run it okay we need to invalidate on resize go to here click here on resize invalidate okay now see this Okay, it's invalidating and position is in center. Okay, now we are going to code hands. For hands, first we need to define hands coordinates. Go to top over here, find multi dimensional. Bracket, comma, bracket, hands coordinates is equal to new point, okay, three, three hands per, per hand, two points, two coordinates, okay, like this. Zero comma zero, zero comma one twenty. Okay, copy this, paste here, paste here, make it forty, make it forty. Okay, now draw hands, use the those coordinate over here. Okay. point comma this m point is equal to new point 3 comma 2 that is going to clone it ok first define angle to the hands int i angle bracket make i small so it will denote integer of length 3 ok i angle bracket 0 is equal to dt dot hours hour multiply by 30 whole modulus 360 
plus dt dot minute dot but divide by two okay and convert it into int okay now i angle bracket 1 is equal to int bracket d t dot minutes multiply by 6 ok that is 2 make it seconds ok now temp point is equal to base underscore we are going to use the hinge coordinate dot clone ok convert that clone into point bracket on this ok now for int i is equal to 0 i is less than 3 i plus plus bracket now we need to check the index of angle ok if change i is equal to change ok question mark then it is 0 else 2 ok now point bracket square bracket any variable is equal to make it array ok temp point bracket i comma 0 now rotate point bracket t comma by 2 it is 2 then i angle bracket i ok now pen is equal to new pen of color C that we forwarded it that one ok now P dot draw line draw line ok bracket pen comma TT bracket 0 comma TT bracket 1 ok now when is not complete pen ok now go to form design save it drag in a timer mm, here it is our timer ok go to event property event tick ok now define two mm, date time variable to track change go to here ok date time current date time previous ok and boolean 
change okay now go over here okay now current is equal to date time dot now okay change is equal to current dot hour not equal to previous dot hour or current dot minute not equal to previous dot minute draw hands bracket this dot create graphics bracket comma current time comma change comma color is same as above this one okay over here bracket now if it change we need to override the previous draw how we need to hide the previous draw to do that we need to first change the background color of form to make our life little easier okay now it is white that is normal 255 255 what it will do it will override the previous change means previous black now is is white and we are going to draw new okay so for new is draw hand bracket this this dot create graphics okay dot current comma true comma the color is this one okay over here then this now save previous will save the current and invalidate okay now copy this go to here paste here now current is now previous okay save it run it it's not showing hands okay i'm going to resolve it okay first this graphics e dot graphics then timer enable it okay still there is error okay one run it okay it's in 180 degree of minus we need to rotate it 180 degree okay e dot graphics dot rotate transform bracket 180 run it okay or is to 10 or is to 10 okay if you like this video please subscribe and share with your friend and don't forget to hit the like button